We're now some 20 kilometers from one of the front lines of the war in Ukraine. To the east of here is the city of Kherson, now one of the major focal points of Russia's offensive. And this city, the city of Mykolaiv, has become a major strategic hub for Ukraine's defense. From here, many of the logistical aspects, the military aspects are organized. And this place has been shelled multiple times over the last few months, including the regional government building in the center of the city. And that's where we met uh, Governor Vitaly Kim, the administrator of this province, who told us about the situation on the ground. He said that Russia's offensive in the south of Ukraine has now stalled and that Ukrainian troops are retaking grounds. In the line of defense, there's a war outside and there is uh, 24 hours per day, they are fighting. So they can stand uh, any time we have. So we have no choice, they will stand. That's it. The message is uh, simple, keep on fighting. And according to Governor Kim, the news that the Russian installed administration in Kherson might ask Moscow authorities to annex the region changes nothing in Ukraine's strategy. He said that they will continue to fight and will ultimately retake grounds. He also had a message of uh, gratitude towards the West, towards European nations, saying that they are uh, glad, uh, very happy with the support they have been receiving, but that more weaponry is needed so that Ukraine and Ukrainian troops can sustain their gains and further advance east to reclaim their sovereignty. Annelise Borges in Mykolaiv, southern Ukraine, for Euronews.